The largest Chinese military aircraft, the Y-20 transport plane, is now close to get its first major upgraded variant. Before I go further, please like, comment and subscribe, thank you. It is widely reported that the Y-20B model with Chinese WS-20 turbofan engines will enter service soon. Also, the Y-20 fleet performed another overseas mission recently. A Y-20 flew to Austria, sending troops and equipment to participate in the 2023 Edelweiss Raid Mountain Warfare Race. This marks the third major mission of the Y-20 in Central Europe. Previously the Y-20 fleet sent anti-aircraft systems to Serbia and carried troops to Austrian Airshow in 2022. The Chinese Y-20 cargo plane is one of the most impressive and advanced cargo aircraft in the world. This aircraft is a true marvel of modern Chinese aviation engineering, and it represents a major milestone for the Chinese aviation industry, especially considering China has not had any aircraft like this before. The Y-20 cargo plane is the largest military transport aircraft ever built in China, and it is also one of the largest in the world. Its design is based on the latest technologies, making it a formidable presence in the Chinese Air Force. With a maximum takeoff weight of over 200 tons, it is capable of carrying up to 66 tons of cargo and equipment. One of the key features of the Y-20 is its versatility. It can perform a wide range of missions, including military and humanitarian operations, as well as commercial cargo transportation. Its size and capacity make it ideal for transporting large and heavy equipment, such as Type 99A tanks and other military vehicles, as well as emergency relief supplies and large-scale construction materials. It can carry one 99A tank, or one Type 96 tank, or two ZBD-03 paratrooper fighting vehicles. Unlike the Russian IL-76 aircraft, the White 20 has a wider body and can hold a Type 99A tank without removing any part to reduce width. The White 20 has been flying for humanitarian missions to South Pacific, Africa, Southeast Asia and Europe. The White 20 is powered by four Russian D-30 turbofan engines, which provide the aircraft with reasonable performance and range. It is now testing the Chinese WS-20 engines. The new engine is being tested and expected to enter service this year. The WS-20 is a high bypass ratio turbofan, making it a generation better than the Russian D-30. It is equipped with a full authority digital engine control system, which provides precise control over the engine's operation. It also helps the Chinese civilian aerospace sector to develop the first indigenous high bypass ratio airliner engine. It has a cruising speed of around 800 km per hour and a range of over 4,500 km, which means it can cover vast distances with ease. This makes it an ideal choice for long-range missions, such as airlift operations or humanitarian missions in remote areas. The White 20's advanced avionics and navigation systems also make it a safe and reliable aircraft. It is equipped with state-of-the-art flight control systems, which provide the pilot with precise control over the aircraft in all weather conditions. The White 20 also has a range of advanced safety features, including an advanced warning and avoidance system, which helps to prevent accidents and keep the aircraft and crew safe. It also carries chuff and flares to counter enemy missiles or fighter jets. It is likely the aircraft is equipped with Battlefield Information Data Network System to enhance its awareness capability, which is a common practice in the latest generation Chinese military aircraft, such as the J-20, the Z-20 helicopter and so on. Finally, it is worth mentioning the significance of the Y-20 project for China's aviation industry. Its development and production have involved a large number of Chinese companies and research institutions, and it represents a major achievement for the country's aerospace sector. Other coming upgrades could include modifications to the cargo hold to enable the Y-20 to carry a wider range of cargo and equipment. Improved fuel efficiency and reduced emissions could also be achieved through the use of new materials and manufacturing techniques. As China continues to invest in its aerospace industry and advance its technological capabilities, we can expect to see further upgrades and improvements to the Y-20 cargo plane. These upgrades will not only enhance the aircraft's performance and capabilities, but also solidify China's plan as a leading player in the global aerospace industry. The Y-20 will serve China and possibly foreign clients for many years to come. Thank you for watching, please subscribe, share and comment.